In an industry where consumer information is becoming more and more valuable, CRM tools create opportunities if they're used properly and to their fullest extent. Some dealers, unfortunately, still do not take advantage. It's amazing how many dealers do not have an idea of how to use data to sell product and how to manage that data correctly and how to build a relationship. In the new car side, a lot of the dealers are just forced to take the OEM uh, approved products without any understanding of why they're taking it. I mean, I've got some customers that are on board that do not use the application as effectively as I think they can. And when you talk to them about it, well, I only need it because of my internet leads and the manufacturer's got to know what's going on and I don't care about the rest. So we have to spend time in educating these people and that hasn't changed, it's actually gotten stronger. Uh, and I think it'll continue to do that way until there's a, a cultural shift in the marketplace and in the dealer body where people understand about the use of data. If you think about social networking, there's revolutions going on in the world because people understand how to take that social network and pass information around and then use it to effectively overthrow governments. What we're teaching the, the, the dealer is to take that information in that CRM application and use it to sell cars. And sell cars no different than they did on paper, but faster and quicker with more information and relationship building. So what we said last year is, is the same theme. If anything, we're trying to figure out a better way to do it to get the point across of their investment that they got to be the champion in the application, not just on the people they sell, but the people they lose. When you lose a customer, you collect data on that customer. I mean, I have a dealer in Texas that has 53,000 upsheets in the last two years. That's how many contacts he's had with customers over the last two years. Not just in his local area, but he does a big internet business. Wow. 53,000. Imagine if he went out to pay for a list of 53,000 names and, and emails and phone numbers. You know, you're collecting that. You need to know how to manage it and use it. This is a high-tech dealer who was in the tech business at one, at one time before. So he, he understands the use of it, and he's pushing the edge of the envelope. We need to get the rest of the dealer body to push the rest of the envelope because if they do, they will see the benefit of a, a simple, easy system that gets the user to be able to collect the data, manage it, build a relationship.